In today's video, I'll be giving you my top five players to upgrade the season one players to an 85 overall first. Before we get into this video, make sure to like and subscribe to be a part of the GOAT gang so you do not miss any Madden or college football content. Before we go over this, let's go over the field pass rewards. And a couple things I want to go over here is the 80 overall BND player tokens and just upgrade tokens in general. So, the 80 overall BND player tokens is actually how you start to get these uh, cards and then you build them up to an 85, but we're also going to go over season tickets uh, at the end of this video. But this field pass is a little bit strange. Uh, the past two years, Madden 23, Madden 24, it has been to level 51. This year, it's going to be to level 35. I don't know if that's going to be upgraded, but that is just what's going to happen. As you see, level 31, you get season 2 XP token, but... Make sure you get on college football very, very quickly because if you get to season, sorry, level 20 in the college football 25 field pass, you will get a MVP season XP pack where you will get to level 10 immediately in the Madden 25 field pass, which is actually very good. So since it's level 35, it might be like lower XP, maybe easier to get the rewards or it's going to be uh, very, very hard. But Madden 25 ultimate team definitely looks better than college ultimate team in my opinion we're gonna go over so i'm gonna have so many videos dropping today and tomorrow uh madden ultimate team is gonna be a big part of this channel and just madden videos in general uh we're gonna have a no money spent series that will definitely be dropping uh i'll be working so hard on that we're also gonna have a lot of videos on madden 25 just in general so let's get in to these 85 overalls here we go with 85 Mike Allstott at my number five spot. You know, utility fullback, but he only has 69 catching, 84 speed, 84 strength, 88, 88 awareness, 83 carrying, 63 run block is not good for a fullback. I know Mike Allstott was kind of a runner. You know, he ran the ball a lot, but for a fullback, 63 run block is very low. 83 lead block is pretty good, but the reason I have him at number five is because he's a fullback. And, you know, upgrading your free tokens uh, using a fullback is not your smartest decision because we're going to go over some other cards that are going to be way better. Mike also, he's fast though. So if you like running the ball and you don't have like, you don't have like the guys like Christian McCaffrey, 84 overall, you don't have Derrick Henry, maybe Mike also will be good, but we're going to go over another running back very, very, very soon. In this video, we're going to go over Ray Lewis at our number four spot. The reason I have him, have him at number four, 73 zone, only 83 speed. Now, I know it's a middle linebacker, but 81 tackling for Ray Lewis is so disrespectful. That should be at least an 85 or 84. 81 tackling is, like I said, so disrespectful. 86 strength, 85 excel, 88 hit power which is unreal he's gonna f cause a lot of fumbles but like i said will you do you really want to upgrade ray lewis first uh before the three other guys we're gonna go over i just don't think so i think uh ray lewis he can be a card you upgrade later on but like you can use season tickets on you know you can use season tickets to get these 80 overall 81 82 83 84 85 overall token so you can upgrade these guys super quickly i mean going over how you can get those season tickets but eight at our number three spot we have christian mccaffrey the reason i have him at number three is that we have a free 81 overall christian mccaffrey a 84 overall christian mccaffrey and then we also have the ultimate alumni 85 overall saquon barkley so what, how you can get that Saquon Barkley is if you go on College Triple Ultimate Team, you can uh, open a welcome pack from the Ultimate Alumni promo, get your get a free tip, which will give you an 80 overall elite player for Madden. And then you have to get, uh, I believe, 90 stars to complete both of the uh, 80 overall Madden 25 cards and the Ultimate Alumni solos. Just, so do that. There is 10 hour trials in this, so you can... If you don't have college football, but you want these cards, make sure you do get that 10-hour trial. And then you can get the season field pass done and the ultimate alumni solos. This Christian McCaffrey card, though, looks very, very good. Let's go, go over his stats. 86 speed, which is incredible. 86 excel, 
88 agility, 83 carrying, 83 catching, 87 change of direction is pretty good, and 62 trucking for McCaffrey is actually not terrible, but that trucking is not too good. 84 break tackle as well. The reason I have him at number three, I just gave you the reasons. Chris McCaffrey, great card. Uh, definitely a player you can upgrade if you do not get that 85 overall Saquon Barkley and you want to go with Josh Hines Allen or Miles Garrett. This, this, these players are going to definitely affect your ultimate alumni pick because there's Christian McCaffrey where there's, where there's a Saquon Barkley. There's a Josh Hines Allen when you have a Ray Lewis. I know that they don't play the same position, but they're both linebackers. And then we're going to go over Max Crosby later in the video where they have Miles Garrett. So if you, you can upgrade like Mike Allstott or Heinz Ward. And speaking of Heinz Ward, we have him right here at number two with 86 speed. That's why he's at number two, just for that reason right there. 86 jumping, 82 catching, 82 catching traffic, 82 spectacular catch, 84 short route running, and 85 medium route running with 80 deep route running. This card looks incredible. I would definitely upgrade this card first if it wasn't for the other guy we're going to go over. That 86 speed, 86 jumping is incredible. It's unreal. 85 medium route running is great as well. 84 short route running. 82 spectacular catch. 82 catch in traffic. Dude, those stats matter. And they're good overall stats. 85 Heinz Ward is definitely going to be a top three receiver in the first week of Madden Ultimate Team. Maybe in like the second week as well. This card looks absolutely incredible. He's not number one though. Because we're going to go over someone who has got a who's got a legend card in college Ultimate Team. And this man is max crosby the reason i have him at number one is because he's at he has 84 speed at left end 86 excel 75 strength 82 hit tackling 81 play recognition 82 block shed 75 power moves is not great but 87 finesse moves the reason i don't have heinz ward at number one is because d linemen matter a lot in any in like this this year cultural ultimate team d line it disrupts every single play because if you're going against a battle line, you got a good D line, you're going to get pressure almost every single play. So if that's the case for Madden, Max Crosby is going to be very, very good. And you're going to get a lot of sacks with him. You're going to pressure the quarterback very, very, very consistently. But 84 speed is unreal. That's the speed in this game is very interesting. Running backs don't have a lot of speed unless and. Well, Christian McCaffrey does. But Max Crosby, 84 speed at a defensive lineman, very, very good. I know he's a left end, but that's for any defensive lineman, 84 speed is definitely going to be the fastest in the game. Another main part is how you get these cards. So in the field pass, you get these 80 overall BND tokens, and that's how you can get these 80 overalls where you can upgrade them all the way up to an 85. Let's go over the tickets right now. And every single time you level up, you get a certain amount of tickets. So since I did the challenges, I get level two to level 10 season tickets. So that's tons of season tickets. You can do the math in your head. I'm not going to do it right now. But season tickets, you can get uh, player tokens to upgrade you those 80 overalls to 85 overalls. Let's go over that right now, the ticket store and how you can get those uh, 80 overall Sorry, 81 overalls, 82 overalls, 83 overalls, 84 overall, and 85 overall tokens. If you get for 75 tickets, you get an 81 overall season one player upgrade token. Now, this is a store, so it's going to be something in the store so you can buy these things. So we actually don't only have player tokens. We also have fantasy packs, some other packs, boomer bus packs. Those packs might be actually pretty good, especially the 79 plus. But for 75 tickets, you can get 81 overall, 200 tickets. 200 tickets, 83, 125 tickets, 82, 625 tickets, 84, and 925 tickets, 85. Now, something that's being talked about is that if you buy the 85 overall player upgrade token, will you get the 85 overall immediately? I don't think so. I don't think they would have the 81 overall, 82, 83, and 84 if it was just going to upgrade immediately for an 85. Let's go over the other offers. We have, we have a... Uh, 275 tickets, 70 plus overall fantasy picks pack. 275 tickets, 71 plus overall value recruitment pack. 275 tickets, 
74 plus boomer bus pack. We also have a 77 plus boomer bus pack and 79 boomer bus pack. We have a 71 overall, 71 plus overall fantasy picks pack. That card, that pack might be really good. 70 plus overall value recruitment pack. And then we got the tokens. And then we have another fantasy picks pack and another value recruit recruitment pack. To be honest, these packs should be very good. If they're 1,000 tickets, they probably have very high odds. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and more Madden 25 content coming out later today. Also, the Nebraska Dynasty Series video. That video was very stressful to make. Just going to give you a little hint there. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to be a part of the GOAT game. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace.